Hi everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to Sam and Max Hit the Road, where we are trying to get Max out of this dunk tank. We managed to get across the elite alligators over to the little island where he is, but now we've got to figure out what to do to get him out of here. So hopefully it's not going to be a whole episode of me trying to figure this out like the golf one was last time out, but we shall see. So, let's try looking at this, I guess, and see what we can it's find. It's a target. It's a target. Can we... I can't pick that up. No, can we use it? Yep, we can. <laughs> hey, knock it off! <laughs> right, okay, let's see what else we've got around here then. Uh, some holes in the side? I'm not really sure what they're doing in there. That's one angry rabbit. It is indeed. Uh, can we... No. Can we use Max to get out? I can't use these things together. I can't use these things... I can't use these things together. No. Okay, can we... No, it won't let us do that. Can we use the door? <laughs> we can! But now Sam's trapped somewhere. Hey Sam! Oh no, he's alright. Hey what? I found another sample of Sasquatch fur in Mange in the booth. Ah. Oh, I spent my young life waiting. Just sitting there. In that horrible booth. Waiting. <laughs> Jeez, Max, get over it. Yeah, it wasn't okay. that bad. Here, you carry it. <laughs> I love how he's just like, okay, then I'd fine. Better. I'm not sure where you'd put it. That's none of your business, Sam. <laughs> I don't want to know. Right, so we've got more of this fur then. It's a hunk of bleach, blonde Sasquatch fur and mange. Suitable That's... for framing. It's a swatch of Bruno's fur and mange. So are these two the same? I can't use these things to... No, they're not. Okay, that's interesting then. Uh, so there's like a door here now that wasn't there before. Can we... I can't pick that up. Can we use it? We can. Okay, what's in there then? Can we... Can we go into it? It's a snow globe from the Mystery Vortex in scenic Goldwump, Washington. Nice. Oh, another new location, okay. Let me see. Take a look. Ooh. Too bad it's empty or we could shake it. Oh, it's empty. Like this? <laughs> I love the way the yeah. screens move in. What's that writing on the bottom of the globe? To Elmo the Bigfoot. Keep on trucking. Shavul the Mole Man. Mm. Hey, maybe Shavul's at the Mystery Vortex. Let's go there before I'm distracted by something. Another Bigfoot and another Mole Man. That's interesting. And unexpected. Yeah, is there anything else in there that we can... Well, it made us move. But I don't think there was from first glance. So let's head back up here. Are we done here now? I guess maybe we're done here for now. We need to go to this vortex place. Yeah, we checked out this bit, didn't we? Yeah, maybe... Oh, the spit is disgusting. Right, um... Alright, let's get back into the car then and check out this new location, I suppose. So it's up here. So we've been here. We've been... There. I don't think we've been to these two places, but let's go to the vortex place first. See as we. Sam, this Whoa. place is making my head ping. That's probably just the metal plate in your head. <laughs> what is this place? This is odd. It is literally Good a vortex. Lord. It's a possessed outhouse. This kind of thing wouldn't happen if they had indoor plumbing. <laughs> Can we even... I can't pick that up. I don't have to go. Right, we don't have to go. Does Max have to go? Because he seemingly needs to go whenever we go somewhere. Who knows what makes these inanimate objects dance their infernal jitterbug? I do, I do. I think they're controlled by a series of really big magnets under the Earth's crust. I really... You're an ignorant dolt, Max. That gives me an idea, because we do have a magnet, right? So can we perhaps use the magnet? I can't magnet? use these things together. I can't use these things together. I can't use these no. things together. <laughs> no is the answer to that. Um, wait, is this... Is this it? Oh no, there's more. Okay. Mystery Vortex. I was going to say, it's a very small location. I wonder if these things spin the other direction in Australia. <laughs> I love it. Uh, wow, there's like some water going upwards here. This place is really trippy. I guess we go in then to the mystery vortex. 
Oh my god, look at this place. This is weird. I like it. Though. An eight ball. What's this little door? It's a small door. Can we open I'd it? I'd never fit through it. What's going on with Max? Oh, <laughs> what the hell? You what? Ah, oh, I wonder if we can Okay. Let's see if we can wait for Max to get small and I then send him through. I can't use these things together. No. Okay. I can't use these things together. No, we can't. Okay. It's a little door. I thought we might be able to get him to go through, but apparently not. Uh, right, so it's like a piano here as well. It's a player piano. I can't pick that up. Don't play it again, Sam. Oh, no, we're shrinking. <laughs> what is going on? This is very weird. Right, so can we go through the door now? Are we... Oh, uh, no, we don't... Wait, yes, okay. Can we perhaps go through then if we're shrinking? I'd never fit through it. I'd never fit through it. I'd never right, it doesn't look like we can go through there then. Uh, okay. So we've got like a ramp going up there. Up some <laughs> this is so odd. It's like a bad trip. Um, it's the seamy underbelly of water. How are we now under the water? What is happening? <laughs> this is utterly bizarre. It's a big door. I can't pick that up. Can we use the big I door? can't reach the doorknob. So now we're too small to reach the doorknob. Brilliant. <laughs> this is an even bigger door here. Uh, can we look at this? No. That's, that's, oh, that's what's making the duck sounds. It's that. It's a big door. Can we open the I door? can't reach the doorknob. No. What's the deal with the mirror then? Oh, this is so strange. The music makes it weirder as well. I like it though, I do like it. Oh, okay. Is it some sort of weird portal? What is that? Oh, okay, that's very weird. <laughs> that's a mirror. <laughs> it certainly is. Right, can we go through there? No. I can't talk to that. We can do it again. Let's just make sure it doesn't chuck something out. Oh, no, we're going in. Max, are you coming? We're going through to the... Whatever's on the other side. <laughs> whatever's on the other side of this mirror. Oh, God. I told God. you this place was controlled by giant magnets buried under the Earth's crust. You were right. Lucky guess. You were absolutely right. Well done, Max. Uh, okay, let's look at these, I guess. So do we have to maybe turn these on and off? It's a big magnet. What did that do? Wow, that's hurting my eyes a little bit. <laughs> it's a big magnet. It's a very big magnet, right. Should we... Can we use this thing? No. Right, well let's go out and see what that did. I mean, I was hoping to maybe turn the magnets off so we could interact with some of this stuff. Uh, hang on, let's... Let's try going up here first, just to make sure there's nothing up... No, there's not. There's also this, I don't know if that's another way we can go. Let's head outside though. See if that made any difference at all. Uh, no. Doesn't seem to have made any difference to that stuff. So let's try going through here again. I'm guessing we're going to have to find like the right combination or something. I love how Max is just so keen to get in there. Right, um... So these are powered on now, right? They weren't powered on before. 
Right, let's see what that does. If anything. Maybe it won't do anything at all, who knows. Right, back out we go. It doesn't seem to be affecting what's going on in this room. It still all seems to be the same. Can we... There we go. No, it all seems to be the same. There we go. So let's head back in. So... Huh. Can we go through here? Let's try this and then we'll have to... I'm not really sure what the deal is with the magnets, I'll be honest. Yipes! Oh! Gravity's taken a holiday and lost its luggage. That's not what I'm about to lose. I think I'm gonna throw up. Throw down. This... Whatever. Is this another Bigfoot thing? What oh does this God. do? That special booth is filled with the magical, mystical mysteries of the universe. Right. Say that one three times really fast. <laughs> okay, can we talk to this person? Hi. Stealth Gib to all the wonk oi <laughs> He's talking backwards. I'm upside down, cutie, not this Lexi. Ah. Oh. I feel like my sense of reality has just exploded. Try cutting down on cholesterol. <laughs> I'm looking for a Bigfoot. You too? I used to have a Bigfoot in that black of ice over there. Yesterday, I stepped out to have my spine recompressed, and when I got back, he was gone. Huh, a lot of big... Spine recompression. Cool. <laughs> a lot of people have their Bigfoots or Big Feet going missing, it seems. Do you know who Conroy Bumpus is? Yes, and he was here looking for a Bigfoot. Then he got sick and had to leave. This place seems to have that effect on people. Okay. Do you sell any snow globes like this one? We used to, but not anymore. Why not? Because they were having an inexplicably bad effect on the vortex. Ah. With every new snow globe we built, the vortex got weaker and weaker. Interesting. The same thing happens when I watch sitcoms. <laughs> so we decided to discontinue the snow globes for financial reasons. Right. I guess this means you don't have any snow globe stoppers. You got it. So that's a no then? <laughs> Are you feeling as mentally unstable as I am? More so. <laughs> It'll wear off in a few hours. All right, if you say we'll so. Be back. Back, front, it's all the same to me. Yeah, I suppose it probably is. Right, let's have a look around then. Uh, can we look at this? Bert the Bigfoot. It's another tuft of Sasquatch hair and mange. My rabbity senses tell me that this is not Bruno's hair and mange. Or maybe I'm in love. <laughs> what? Right, anyway, can we get that? We can, nice. Some more Bigfoot fur and mange. Lovely. Uh, okay, Bigfoot song. Bigfoot. Lovely. Museum gift shop. What's this? Is this like a wanted poster? Or a missing poster, I should say? Oh, this place is so weird. Can we use this? Can we try the vortex? Step right in. Is this going to make us lose our invent stuff again? <laughs> Hopefully not, right? Why does it sound like a car engine? Oh my god, what's going on? What did that Neat. do? Nothing, apparently. Absolutely nothing. Okay, well, let's go through here then. So can we... Can we open this? I can't pick that up. I can't reach the doorknob. Oh, we're just teleported tiny I can't then. reach the doorknob. Right, so can we go through any of these doors in here then? Or are they... Can we use this? The eight ball? Might be able to use the eight ball. Hey, eight ball. Will Max and me be together forever? That's touching, Sam, but ask it something important, like, uh, when's our next meal? <laughs> Definitely more important. Oh, we can talk to it. Will we ever finish this for Schlugener quest? <laughs> yes. 
Oh, it talks. Well, at least we know we'll finish the quest then. Will I ever recapture the carefree innocence of my youth? No. Aww. That's a shame. Right, let's see what I else it has to say. I can't pick that up. Are you lying? Yes. Huh. Well. I'd never fit through it. So we don't, we can't, I'd never we fit can't through go through it. any of these doors. There's got to be more to this in here, surely. I don't know what, though. But there's got to be, so, there's a reason we can turn these magnets on and off. I have no idea what that reasoning is. But there's definitely a reason for it, isn't there? Uh, right, so what happens if we turn them off? So it's all blue now, right? That makes it go back to normal. This makes it go red. This makes it go... I don't know, some weird pinky colour, I guess? Or like a pinky purple colour? I honestly have no idea. Alright then guys, that's where we'll leave it for this one then, because we've made a little bit of progress, come to a new place, but we're going to have to try and figure out what we're actually supposed to be doing here, but it's got to have something to do with those magnets. Um, so, as always, thank you very much for watching it. A big thank you to our patrons, Arcades Games, Wayne and Nate for all the support, I really do appreciate it. If you enjoyed the video, hit that like button, it really does help YouTube push this out to more people who might want to watch it, and people who might want to join our little point and click community that we're building here, and I'll see you all next time!